Hey guys, so I haven't uploaded a video in the past, what, mm, three weeks? Uh, I guess I just haven't had the time. Um, our computer is like in our bedroom and the kids are like in the living room slash their own bedroom. So it's kind of hard to edit in here and then having to watch those two at the same time. Um, especially because our bedroom is not exactly baby proof or Alice proof so we just it's just hard so I'm thinking of maybe trying to convince my husband to move the computer to our living room but we shall see but today it's going to be another unboxing video for Aloe Crate I'm actually kind of excited for this box mostly because they passed two boxes were actually pretty good. You know, the January and the February box. So, I'm excited. So let's go ahead and open this. Oh, there it is. Okay, so, oh, it's cute. So the card of the month is actually pretty cute. Uh, you see it's this card right here. And there's a typewriter, notebook, a coffee, the owl crate folder right there. And here's um, some old books that were featured in their boxes and look at their Apple phone right there. And I guess this month's, um, this month's theme is, what does it call it? Writer's block. So I guess it's contemporary, so let's find out. Um, find out what's in the box. So obviously, I don't like these, but whatever. Oh, first thing I see are these, um, I think these are pins. They are, they're pins. Bookworm Boutique pins designed exclusively for Owl Crate. And so this is what it looks like. That is not that very, very pretty? Love it. Um, um, next, they're custom packs of pins. Okay. Oh, next are socks. These are out of print band books socks. So this is actually what my, these are socks. So these are out of print socks. I don't know what these socks are. And book socks. If you guys have any idea what these prints are, let me know. I can't tell. Is it me? Am I just, yeah, so. Let me know. But it's nice. I, it's always nice to have socks. Next thing I see here is, ooh, it's 642 Tiny Things to Write About by the San Francisco Writers Grotto. Introduction by Poe Bronson. And this is what it looks like. That is very nice. And this is the back cover along with the spine right there. And I guess there's like questions and things to write about. So I guess these are used to help um, writers block. Like they kind of inspire you to write stories. So that's kind of cool. Interesting. I like that. Um, ooh. And I got a little, what do you call this? A quill pen from Kirkland. Oxio pen. And it's like this is a pen. <gasps> that is amazing. There you go. Look at that. It's a pen. It's an awesome pen. Ah. The Harry Potter in me. Pen. Yeah. Yeah. Is it a pen? It's a pen. It's a feather. I got a feather on it. Yeah, there's a feather on it. And a wiggle, wiggle. Yeah, wiggle, wiggle. Oh. I 
Alice, how did you take off your pants? Alice, why did you take your pants off? Okay, so the book for this month is The Serpent's King by Jeff Zentner. I actually have never heard of this book. So this is pretty cool. This is part of the book. And I guess Travis, Lydia, and Dill, they write their favorite quotes on a column under a bridge. And so Owl Crate is doing this thing where I guess you share with them um, by writing on the column with them on Instagram using uh, hashtag Owl Crate King for a chance to win a free Owl Crate. You have until May 15 to enter. So I guess your favorite quote will be right there. Um, and then you just hashtag it on Instagram. So that's kind of interesting. Um, actually, you might want to do that. And not only that, Jeff Zentner also wrote a nice little letter to the Elks Crate readers. And that is always very, very nice. Um, so, love it. It's nice to have like little stuff like that from the author from a book like this. It's, you know, it's not just like a signature on the book, but you have something a little personal. Even though, yes, many thousands of other Owl Crate subscri scrub subscribers, sorry, even though, yes, a lot of other thousands of Owl Crate subscribers may have the same, you know, postcard here, um, copy postcard, uh, but it's still a nice little touch to the book, I guess. I don't know. Anyways, so that's what I got. Beautiful, beautiful books. Beautiful, beautiful. Look at that. I, there's so many good things to this book. So. so I guess that's it for today. And I will see you guys all in my next video. When will that be? I have no idea. But the kids need to go to bed now, so... Talk to you later. Bye. Where's your pants?